Hello, friends and lovers, Italian. This is Pile Up. This is a brand new roguelike, supposedly some kind of base building sandboxy thing. We're going to try it out for the first time here today. I think this game cost me under $10. I'm looking at the Steam page really quick. Yeah, it cost me eight bucks. I bought it a few days ago. Well, let's check it out, shall we? Let's see what it's all about here. It's supposed to be a bit more relaxing, chill, so hopefully I can emanate that in some way. <laughs> Do you want to learn about the island? Sure. I don't know how to play, so. In Pile Up, your goal is to increase the population of your island as much as possible. Change selected Q slash E. Doesn't do anything in it right now. As your island's population increases, your island will level up. Okay. To increase the population, you need to build houses. Select the buildings below using left click. Of course, we have small house. Don't ask why there are three people inside. Portable house. People are small, so we pile up 12. Jeez. Gardenless house. Just a house, no garden. And home office, a fine piece of art. So small house, I guess we'll build. Great. Now place your cursor anywhere on the island and press left click to place the building. Okay. Plus three, huh? I guess, you know, you want to min-max, right? So I guess we'll put them in, like, the very corner. You'd think you'd want to do the smallest ones last, though, would you not? Oh, oh, it can actually overhang the island, it looks. Done. Uh, all right, make that go away, please. I can't. Gardenless house. Let's try to put that... Okay, it can also overhang, but only slightly. A bit hard to see. Okay, you can move the camera around and everything. Gardenless house. That's the same thing, right? That's what we just... No, is it what we built? I don't think it is, actually. Plus 45. That's big. Don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to assume we want to overhang as much as possible, though, right? Because I'm imagining that this is a game where... Uh, you need to build as much onto a very small space as possible, right? Deselect the building by using right-click. To have more control over your land, you can move the camera. Oh, I see. Drag camera. Yep. Rotate the camera. Oh, I see. That helps. Okay. Press R to rotate the buildings. Oh, right. Rotate the buildings. Okay. Okay. So I guess you'd put, like, the small house here, right? It'll let me. Oh, wait, it wants me to rotate. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now you can place these buildings as you want using left click. You got it. Hmm. One, two, three, four. What else we got here? Does anything fit better here? I guess we'll put that... Uh, let's squeeze this in over here. I kind of wish it just appeared red when it didn't fit well. We have two of these left, so we'll squeeze it into here, right? If it'll let me. I guess that's all that stuff is just for aesthetic. Hey, that worked out pretty nicely, I think. We got some stuff. When your population hits certain milestones, you get factories so you can keep developing your city. Every factory gives you buildings of its own type. You can't pass the turn without placing every building that you have. Okay, then. House factory will generate a house until it drains out. I assume I can't put it over there. We just push it as far outward as possible here? I suppose so. Hmm... I wonder if that roof style has a consequence in some way. That doesn't fit in there, right? No, it does not. Ooh, this fits over here beautifully. I didn't read what kind of factory that was. <laughs> support factory, a factory that generates support buildings. I support that. Uh, it kind of leaves an awkward space there, huh? It doesn't fit into here. I guess I'll put it here. When you place each one of your buildings, you can pass the turn by pressing space. Okay. In the bottom right. 
Every factory gives you buildings of its own type. Okay. Can you see the bubbles over your houses? Uh, these colors, right? Oh no, what does that mean? These are the needs of your buildings. To keep your people happy, you need to provide these needs. Oh my god. While they are, well, they are pretty angry at the moment since the requirements aren't being provided. If you can't make your people happy, you'll get kicked out. I'll get kicked out. And finally, sometimes people die. You can't make dead people happy. True, true. Requirement buildings provide needs. Some buildings can have their own situations. These situations are usually really important and require focus. Huh. Read the warning by hovering your mouse over it. Big house. It's talking about this. Explosive danger. This building can explode when in contact with igniting buildings like electricity. When in contact with igniting buildings. Solid. This building cannot be destroyed. Okay. So I I want to make sure... Oh, this is a gas tank. So I'd want to make sure this stays away from certain things. Does it matter where we place these in the meantime? Oh no, explosive. So you'd want this in like a corner then probably, right? One would imagine. I did just do that. This thing is not... What is this? A platform? That goes above it. Oh, you stack up. Well, I guess that was kind of obvious. It's called pile up, right? <laughs> Hello? Okay, let's put that there. I don't know what to do with this platform. Oh, you can overhang it off the edge. Okay, that works. Wish I could see better here. Uh, Gives us more space and everything, right? Let's do that. Shift to speed up all animations. And then skip the turn. Okay. Control to use the top-down camera. Oh, wow. Why can't I... I want to go up. <laughs> I want to go up. Hard to rotate. Drag the camera. Hey, come on. Let me go up. <laughs> I can't. I can't seem to center it. I don't know why. Rotate. I don't know. All right. Well, let's uh, just keep placing here. What do we got here? Roof cannot place. You can't place any object on top of this building. Okay. And then we got a home office again. Uh, can I squeeze this home office between these two? On the ground here. Ooh, ooh, I think we can. I can get the camera to behave for me here. The camera is a bit tough to work with. It's like zooming out at points and everything. All right, that's actually where we want to put it. So the top down did help us. Uh, they have a lot of needs that I don't totally understand yet still. The park, huh? Should I just put it on the platform? You can actually make it overhang on this even, which is odd. So... <laughs> That's so weird, right? Sometimes you'll need to make choices, choices when your population hits certain milestones, okay? Sometimes you'll select an action factory with risky buildings. Let's you pass the round even though you still have a stack of building left by destroying them. Huh? Isolated keeps the buildings rather than destroying them. Let's you pass the round even though you still have a stack of building left by destroying them. Isolated keeps the buildings rather than destroying them. Oh, it's telling me things. Great advantages if you use them right, but it can also bring you your doom. Also bring your doom, too. <laughs> the translation was going great until we hit this part. Population of buildings under roof buildings increases by 50, 75, 100%. What's, what's this trying to tell us here? 
Oh, okay, I don't actually pick one. Special buildings, on the other hand, are really powerful buildings, some even being able to change how the game works. Go on, select now. Pass the round. Okay. Contains three casinos. Three casinos. These are all literally the same. All right, then. <laughs> Dump. Let oh, that's what we picked. Let's you pass the round, even though you still have a stack of building left by destroying them. Isolate. Keeps the buildings rather than destroying them. Okay. So I can potentially choose... If I keep the dump isolated, I think is the idea. Right? Then... It's not touching anything. I, I assume that's what it means by isolated. I'm not 100%. So if it's not touching anything, then I can pass around without using all the buildings. I assume you one way to lose is to... Have nowhere to place the buildings in your hand, right? A factory that lets you craft a limited number of unique and risky buildings. This factory will generate three casinos. Generate a house till it drains out. Okay, should we just start placing here? That does not fit in there, sadly. That fits quite nicely, though. Support factory. Trying to see this. I don't know if I'll find anything that really fits in there. I'll put this right here. I want to be careful that dump. Okay, end turn. Congratulations, now you're ready to build your own island. I wish you explosion-free days. Uh-oh, I'm concerned. Wait, what? Oh, okay, now we got to start an actual run. <laughs> Wrecked land. All right. Pylean. Hey, that sounds... Hey, wait, that sounds like like me. You know what I mean? Just a little bit, at least. All right. That's kind of too bad. I wanted to continue what we had there. But I guess... Hmm. What can you do? Stack. Area. <laughs> okay, so now we have goals and everything. Lovely. All right. Gardenless house, portable house, home office, small house. Okie dokie. Let's get going. Gardenless house. This is smaller. This overhangs just right. Portable house. This one might not be able to overhang, it looks. You can't put anything on that. Yeah, this one can't be overhung. I wonder if I should just put it here. Sure. We have to place everything. Oh, we got more stuff. Maybe I shouldn't have placed that yet then. A uh, house factory. So, I guess, like, the roof of this one looks kind of weird. And I wonder how I should work with that. I'm going to overhang that part of it. Maybe it's fine. I can't really tell. Requirement factory. That overhangs well. This kind of leaves an awkward amount of space there, huh? Can this go right, like, right here? No. It's all about that spa spatial planning, isn't it? Hmm. We'll see what happens. Okay, home office. We got an electric generator. So this will trigger an explosion if it's near it. This building cannot be destroyed. That's the platform. It's probably not a bad idea to put it over here or here. Either way. Yeah, I don't think it matters too much. Igniting. Can that... Is there a chance this, this can go over here? No. So you want this, like, in a far away spot from everything else, kind of? What about just, like, on the edge of the platform, maybe? Might not be a bad idea. As far away from everything else as possible. 
This doesn't fit over here, right? Nope. Okay, home office can go right there. So this can ignite things. I just got to remember that. Something tells me that's it's going to be easy to accidentally put something that's going to explode right there, right? Okay. Uh, hello? Oh, there we go. Getting comfy, getting cozy. Chill game, right? So let's chill out. So this is a gas tank. That's the thing that you don't want to put near the generator. The needs thing, like, I don't really have control over that stuff, right? Do I need to put these things... Oh, you're supposed to put it near stuff. That probably makes sense. So now they're happy. Whereas putting the generator was probably not the best. Hmm. Will this fit over here? It actually will. Shockingly. Okay. I understand now. It is a bit awkward though, is it not? I don't know if it was worth it. Okay, and turn. So that electricity is useless. But I can't put them close to that anyway. So maybe I should have split up the houses? I don't know. This building will destroy what's below it next turn, excluding the same buildings or solid buildings. It's a water tank. So, maybe, okay, so we'll put it on the bottom and we're fine. There we go. And people are happy, of course. So green means they want a garden. They want electricity. That's going to be hard to do. I can't tell what they're going to want ahead of time, can I? That's too bad. Let's see. I could put that there. Cannot put it right there. This seems to fit okay. There's one little slot right there, though. Okay, continue. Roof. You can't place any object on top of this. Okay. This is a park. Okay. So if you put that here, it would make them happy, but... Then you can't build on top, which kind of sucks. You gotta be careful here, huh? Hmm... So I could have it, like, overhang over here. It hits up three people, at least. Right? I don't know, though. Maybe we just do it over here. Seems kind of better, even though not as many people are happy. It's hard to know what the requirement is exactly there. And this is a home office. Yeah, we'll put it near the garden and everything. They don't get the burner. That's the thing. Ahead of, I don't know what these buildings want ahead of time. So knowing what to build seems kind of hard. Where to put them because of that? Portable house. Same thing with this one. We just don't know. So they probably want water and electricity, because I think this is a portable house too, right? Pretty sure. So I can try to put it near the somewhere in between the electricity and the water here. Maybe on the bottom in the corner, like right here? Yeah, I just didn't get the electricity is all. Oh wait, that's the electricity. <laughs> in hindsight, I should have put the electricity over here, but yeah, we didn't know. Okay, we're learning. I can't, like, move things, right? Can't really click on anything. Gardenless house. Just a house, no garden included. So, I feel like the fact that they say it's gardenless makes me think that they want a garden, right? Nearby. Okay. Really lacking electricity now. Some of these turns are really short, huh? Portable house. Is that close enough to the electricity? We can't tell, sadly. Can't build it there. I wonder why, though. Hmm. 
put it right there. Okay. Because last time I needed electricity and water. And I, the water has a pretty big range, it looks. A home office. So they wanted a burner last time. Because I think we put that there. I don't want to put it on top of that thing. Or do I? Can I? Does that fit there? That's a pretty good spot. Oh, will it fit though? I mean, will it? Is that close enough to that? It is. Okay. It didn't get electricity. So we're probably going to want to put something, if we find more electrical stuff, to put it like down here. Somewhere. Another water tank. So we got one covered kind of on this side. So we could kind of put one all the way over here-ish. Maybe just like all the way in this corner, to be honest. Although, maybe I should hit up that this one building right here. It kind of just covers everything, so I guess that's fine. Portable house. This one wants electricity still. Can't put that on the garden. Now I can build this here. I swear they didn't let us last time. Am I crazy? Okay, and turn. More home office. They want a burner and... Is it just a burner? Burner and electricity, but they might not get both here. Probably not. I'll try to put them in between. Watch them get neither now. They didn't get electricity. Home office again. Let's assume that you kind of just can't get both. I'm going to say. We'll try to put some... I mean, if they're going to give me some electricity... One of these days... I'll try to put it somewhere where they want it. Apartment complex. Be careful, the walls are thin. So it's tall. We don't know what they want. Huh. Hmm. Shall I assume electricity? And water, maybe? Oh my gosh, the water didn't reach! You gotta be kidding me! It must barely be out of range, huh? That stinks. Huh. Really lacking electricity. More car apartment complex. Uh, so this is probably in range now, but not of electricity. Stack land is gone to Stackville. So we got like a level up. Scraps. Scraps are upgrade points which are used for unlocking new buildings. Generates a watchtower every three turns. Tains Casino. Curse or bless your day when played. These are all the same, right? As far as we can tell. Let's you craft a limited number of unique and risky buildings. Gener generates a house until it drains out. Okay. Watchmaker generates a watchtower every three turns. Put that there. It's a bit awky. Put that over here. You probably need like electricity anyway, right? That seemed to work out. Okay, action factory. The factories don't seem to need stuff. Like supplies. It's just the housing, huh? It would appear that way. Okay, in turn. Now what do we got? We got another roof. Uh, big house, home office. Okay. The park could help over here. I guess it might be time. 
we can make it overhang as much as possible there. So now they are really happy. This is a home office. Can I remember what the home office is like? Or is it escaping my brain? Is it the burner? I feel like it's the burner. Am I crazy? I don't know. It won't let me put it there for some reason. Are they happy? Possibly no electricity. Kind of hard to say. Big house. That's a big one. Okay. We have no idea what they want. I just drop it. It won't fit on the bottom floor here. Kind of drop it in between, like right in the middle of everything, best we can. So hopefully they got the stuff that they want. It's getting hard to see. They didn't get electricity, apparently. No one gets electricity here. <laughs> Living in the Middle Ages. Home office again. Okay. Here, just go over there. Right on top of the generator. Perfect. Casino. Thought I already made one of these, honestly. Plus one hundo. We don't really know what they want from that. <laughs> We got a neutral doodad, apparently. Why? Doesn't do anything other than always be there for you. So it's solid, so it cannot be destroyed. So it's good to put under... Like a water tower, probably, right? I guess a water tower could wind up here-ish. Oh, it's actually one of those heads. Although you can't really see it. I think it's down there now. We got a big house, we got a home office, we got a watchtower. Destroys last building placed and gives a copy of it. Oh. Huh. It's kind of weird, right? Why would I want to do that? Hmm. Can't really make out what's going on over there. <laughs> Not fully. Okay, that's all connected, though. Watchtower, huh? Put that over here. So it did destroy it. But it gave me a copy of it. That's really weird, right? Okay, I guess. So when can I have some more electricity, please? I feel like I'm missing out. Gardenless house. So I just put it near a garden, basically, as far as I can tell. Which could be right here? God, nothing really fits. I feel like my city looks terrible so far. <laughs> okay, portable house, home office. That fits way down bottom there. Perfect. Home office. I don't know. Just keep it going right here, basically. They want a garden. Okay, we got a bunch of stuff here. We got a gas tank. Not many people want gas. We got to be careful here because there's the electricity. That's a different gas tank. There's a few people wanting gas around here. Uh, 
affordable house is extra small. Seems like a good spot for that. Gas tank is explosive. So the main thing is you don't want to put it in range of the electricity here. You can kind of see when it touches it. I think. If you look at the right. But we want to make sure that does not happen. It says nice. Okay, that's good. <laughs> Another casino? Uh, can I put it on top of the other one? <laughs> oh my god, I kind of can. I straight up can. Uh, maybe we'll give it electricity? I don't know. Like, as far off here as possible. What do we got? Something good? Something good? We got a happy jackpot. Wow. Human capacity increases significantly for each jackpot. We got a hotel. Grants 500. The number increases each time you get another one from a casino. Ooh, baby. We also have the watchtower. So I can destroy... Oh, wait a minute. So here's what we can do. We destroy... That casino and we roll it again? Hello, watchtower. You're being weird. I feel like it's not letting me place it where we want exactly here. What if I place it on top of the casino? Like, what happens? They both got destroyed. But I did get the casino back. Okay. Maybe I want to put the hotel first. I don't know. Okay, let's overhang that. Why not? Requirement factory. Kind of just want to fill this gap here if we can, and that we can. Support factory. Fill that gap too, I suppose. Here's the hotel. It's actually really small, huh? I guess I want to put it... So we have gas and electricity very close to each other here. So if possible, like right here, it's near a park. Hopefully it's close enough to water, too. Look at that. Look at that bonus, huh? Beautiful. New casino again. And we roll a hotel. Not a hotel. We got another Mwai. Cannot be destroyed. Oh god, I can't see. <laughs> Good luck! <laughs> you know what I'm kind of suddenly reminded of? It's like Pacross 3D for the 3DS. Really fun, quirky game, but it was just so impossible to see anything. <laughs> and the camera was your number one enemy for sure. Huh. I'm trying to think, like, where would we put a water tank? Because that would be the purpose, right? Kind of. Put a water tank on this bad boy. Probably like up here somewhere. This casino wants water. But I guess the, nether, the next water tank would be somewhere up here. It's kind of like a random placement, I realize, but... Got a lot of stuff now. Oh, so maybe we generate, like, a lot more stuff. Got a platform, too. Uh, as time goes on, and it becomes harder and harder to place everything, right? Gardenless house. That's fine. We got another gas tank, which I really don't want. I gotta say. Like, no one actually needs gas in our town, which is bizarre. No one needs electricity over here, really, so I guess we'll just put it over here. This is safe. A platform, huh? Can't put it there. That probably would have been nice. Like, right here is fine, I guess? I'm fine with the fact that if it's undestroyable, as they say. Affordable house, big house... Where's my electricity? 
Can't put this over here, can I? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yes, we can. Hope I don't lose because people need electricity and I can't seem to give it to them. That would be frustrating. And put that there, I guess. All right, next turn. We got another water tank, so that's perfect. Leaking. Danger this building will destroy what's below it next turn, excluding the same building or solid buildings. Oh, so you can build up a water tower, potentially. I guess, huh? Wait, it won't destroy, like, the things I got under that, will it? I don't think so, right? Cardinal's house, portable house. Okay. That's fine. This is a teeny tiny one. I'll put that like underneath here, sure. Can we reach the 5k, I wonder? Okay. Finally, an electric generator. Okay, so we have to think and be extra careful here. Because we do have... Yeah, it even warns you that it's going to ignite something. You can see it turn red. What's the best placement here? Maybe like right here. Oh wait, that's going to blow up the thing. Okay, right here then. That's too close. That definitely gets a lot. Perfect placement, it claims. Let's go, baby! Okay. Gardenless house. That's pretty close to a garden, right? Stackville into Stack Town. That will not go there, though, sadly. Drains a watchtower every three turns. Okay. These are all the same. I kind of don't get that. Oh my god, so many buildings! <laughs> Okay, so this is a gardenless house. All right, portable house. That's a smallie, like right here, ish. Another casino. Now you'd like to have some electricity going to this bad boy, right? Wait, we have a watchtower to destroy the casino after we make it. We got a bunch of crap. Hmm. Why can't I put that there? Let me put it there. Come on. No dice, it says. Wonder why. Not the casino yet. Action Factory. Ah, it's getting really hard to see. Come on. Okay. Requirement Factory. Oh, that alleyway is too narrow, huh? That's fine. How much do I want this thing near? There was some kind of placement. Okay, what do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Oh, no, 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 no. Unlucky. Debt ignites itself when placed. Are you kidding? So it's going to destroy something, huh? Oh my god, it's huge. Goodbye, casinos. Okay. That's probably not great, right? It's kind of hard to tell. <laughs> Maybe that was a good thing, you know? <laughs> Watchtower. Let's try to fill in some of the gaps here, I suppose. Does that fit? In? I don't think that actually fits in how I want. I guess I'm just gonna... Pl I have to place a watchtower, right? If I hit space... Yeah, it doesn't work. Oh, right, the dump was in the previous... Tutorial one. 
Wherever I put this watchtower is going to be kind of a dead end, so... Okay, now I'm just going to put it back, to be honest. I guess I should have played around that better. Okay, and turn. Finally, that was a really long one now. Got all this stuff, huh? We have another electric generator. That's good. We have another park. That's probably good. Can you put it on top of the water tower? You can. I think I'm okay with that. Mm, maybe that's weird. I'm kind of second guessing myself here. Okay, so I might want to build up a little bit before I place this electric generator. I'm thinking over here-ish. That's fine. Gardenless house, portable house. Okay, can we do this? Kinda. How do I lose exactly? It's not hitting anything. I probably want to center it though. Right? There we go. Very good. And turn. We got another park. We got another... Okay, now you're giving me too much electricity. Right? There's something that needs electricity over here. And over here, I guess. That's the tower thingy. So there is something that explodes over there. Should probably build it more up if possible. Home office. No. That fits there nicely. We'll put that there. I didn't build anything weird, right? No. Nothing. It's not hitting anything, right? It didn't appear that way. Nicely done. We got a bunch of happy little clams in here. keep saying roof. Oh, because it keeps trying to get me to build the roof. That's why. No one actually wants a, that right now. But we have to build it. Uh, On top of this doodad? It's kind of wasteful, maybe. Maybe just over here. I thought I saw a placement that was kind of interesting. That's fine. Kind of spread out, right? Okay. Watchtower, apartment complex, a gas tank. We got a casino, so we want to place the casino, then place the watchtower. A casino on top of a casino. Help me. Hotel, hotel, hotel. We got another Moai, so let's build the watchtower. The watchtowers are probably not great, to be honest. So that destroyed the casino. So then we place another casino on top of the casino. And we get a hotel. Dang. Another one of these doodads. That's fine, I think, I hope. Who needs gas? We see one unit that needs gas. Uh, maybe two units. That's not gonna... I can only seem to hit one or the other. I cannot seem to get them both, sadly. It's kind of just a question of who we want to have. I guess I'll do it over here. Okay. An apartment complex. Wait, where was that? It showed me like a weird build location, didn't it? I swear it did. Like off hanging a lot. Maybe I'm crazy. I could be crazy. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Hmm. Where are we 
going with this, huh? What are we doing here? I don't know. I can't decide. Next to the casino. Uh, where would we potentially want a water tank now? I'm kind of wondering. Up the center, probably. We have a water tank, like, here. I guess, like, over here is a possibility. Can't totally tell what I'm looking at here. Beautiful. <laughs> Absolutely astounding. Magnificent. Can I build underneath that? Can't really tell. I don't think so. Okay. That'll work, though. Still going. I haven't built up that much, admittedly. Oh, this is perfect, kind of. Didn't I just build? Yeah. I mean, we don't actually need a water tank yet, but... Boom. Another apartment complex. It seemed to work well over here, so I guess I'll just put it over there again. Oh, I have another one. Beautiful. Come on, give me another. Uh, it might not look as nice on top of the casino. Maybe not on top of the casino. Come on. Ah. I feel like we haven't really hit any trials or tribulations still. I don't know if I'm getting lucky or if it's going to happen on eventually or what. Okay. That's all fine. Sure. I mean, we're only like halfway there, it looks, right? We got another watchtower. So this will still destroy the building from last turn, potentially. One would assume. Why can't I put it there, huh? Riddle me this game. Hmm. I still destroyed the building from last turn. I guess I was wondering if it would count last turns when the destruction would happen. Put that there, I guess. Put this under here. That does not fit. Put that there. It's kind of leveling out nicely. Next turn, we got a park. Nobody really wants one still. More apartment complexes. Can I squeeze that? I think we can. Come on. I don't think that's right. I feel like I feel like it's there. No. If I move the camera angle. Oh, oh, oh. No, that's like too far out, I think. Come on, like one over. This is so hard. If I do this, does that help? Not. R oh, wait. It showed it. I think. But it was red. Okay. Okay, it won't let us do it, I guess. It'll be slightly lopsided then, I suppose. Another casino! Sure. On top of this casino? Absolutely. And a hotel! Damn it! Unlucky. So I can destroy... Can you put stuff on top of the watchtowers? I'm kind of thinking, like, you destroy those, maybe, right? Uh... I think it's showing that it won't let me put it there. It's kind of hard to tell, though. Yeah, I, don't, I, I assume you can't build on those. Those things suck. And I guess I just destroyed this casino. It'll let me. Rip. So we got another park that I gotta build, put somewhere. 
Kind of got parks everywhere. Probably put one over here. Home office. Okay. Seems like a decent place for that. All right, looking good. And turn. <laughs> Another watchtower, apartment complex, home office. Kind of doesn't matter. I'm worried that we're going to get too many of these stupid watchtowers. I mean, you got to place what you get. There's no way around it. Kept getting uh, watchmakers. Oh, crap. That did not go where I thought. okay, I guess. Hmm. Right there is fine. And Toyn. What do you got? A uh, gas tank. I don't think anyone needs gas, really. We're lacking water over here now. Big house. I gotta build up from the bottom more here because... Like, you can't even make out what's going on there anymore. I've built up too much around the edges. And so it's really hard to build it down there now. Yeah. I'm just gonna put that there even though I can't really see it well. <laughs> A gas tank. I believe that's electrical over there, right? Hmm. Oh, someone needs gas over here, I guess. A couple people. I don't think that hits anything, right? Wouldn't appear that way. So I guess you could be forced to place something that causes a big explosion because you have nowhere else to put it. It's a possibility, right? We have a casino. I'm feeling different today. Let's put it right there instead. And a hotel. Oh, come on. You gotta be kidding me. Where can I put this thing? I really can't put it on these watchtowers, right? Oh, wait, hold on. I gotta build this first. Stupid watchtowers. Uh, keep them clustered up over here, I suppose. There we go, sure. Alright, roll that casino again, baby. This time, though. Ugh. Kaboom. Park. So this thing's lacking water, so I guess we could want to build a water tank up here somewhere. Uh, Let's put it right here. That's fine. This is an apartment complex, huh? There's something satisfying about trying to keep them all together, I guess. Trying. Can we fit something, like, down? Kind of hard to tell. We adjust the camera angle every time here, too. Okay, right there is fine. Oh, we have another one. Okay. Now we got a roof. I guess we'll... What if we put it on the top of the casino now? Oh, it won't even let us? Oh, it will. That's stupid. You might want to put more casinos over there, honestly. Just put it right there. I think. Oh, wait, what's this mean? Your citizens are irritated. You will lose in five turns. What did I do? Is it because of the explosions? It's not my fault, though. Wait, I thought I was doing good. Four turns. How do you make them happy? <laughs> I don't understand. We're lacking electricity over here, it looks now. What did I do wrong? Tell me. 
I'm gonna guess it has something to do with the explosions, but I don't really know. No one needs gas. Like, I feel like there's barely needs around here. Some electricity things. Hmm. Really don't need gas, huh? So if this explodes... Wait, will it actually explode? It just destroys it. Okay, that works fine. Okay, we, we found out, I guess. Is this fine over here? I just kind of want to put it somewhere safe. Appears to be fine. I don't know what I did wrong. Can't put that there. Can't put that there. Oh, we got to level up. Does that change anything? Doesn't really seem that way. I thought maybe because we weren't winning quickly enough? This factory would generate seven casinos. That's a lot of casinos. Support factory. That's fine. I saw something. I saw something. Oh, can we move it over one? What do you want from me, my citizens? What have I done to deserve this? You got a platform. You got a casino. Maybe more casinos will make them happy. Hotel? Oh, come on! Does it have something to do with that? I, it must just have to do with me not meeting their basic needs enough. Right? That's the only way I can see it. Although, I, I felt like it was fine. I felt like it was okay. But I guess I was wrong. I was wrong. Where am I putting this doodad? Sure. Two turns! They are irritated. I think we're done, right? They can't seem to make them happy. Okay. I don't know what to do. Keep everything near this electrical thing, just in case, I suppose. Hmm. I don't know. The game has, hasn't really told us, has it? Well, it looks like that's it for us. Right? Is that it? We lose? Social crisis. Land lasted for 36 days. I don't know what went wrong. I wish the game kind of explained it. I'm going to guess that we're missing out on... We just had too many things missing for them or something like that, but yes, yeah, says, uh, your citizens got angry with you and started a riot, but why? <laughs> but why? Oh, well, it's interesting. It is definitely relaxing. It definitely hits that note. Oh, wait, what is all this then? Gives one random requirement and generates three brick roofs. Oh, there's meta progression. We'll place every factory in touch, gives five buildings from themselves and gets drained. Every factory in touch is five buildings from themselves and gets drained. Okay. Is two more of itself when destroyed, the slum. If your happiness decreases below 50%, this building forgives half of the deaths. Oh, deaths! Gives one from each factory and lets you draw another special once. Maybe I have to do with the deaths. I only destroyed casinos, though, but casinos were worth a lot, maybe? Is that the problem? Maybe. Anyway, everybody, that was Pile Up. It's kind of fun. It's interesting, right? 
It's definitely like slower paced and stuff. So if you're looking for something a bit more relaxed, I guess. It's, it's definitely pretty unique as far as I can tell. There's a lot of stuff here, huh? That you could potentially unlock. But all right. Thank you all so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. You know the dizzy. And I'll check you out in the next video. Let me know what you think. Bye-bye. We are moving. Oh, we're falling back. We appear to be falling onto Ash Twin for some reason.